The former New South Wales Labour Minister Milton Okopoulos has been charged with fresh child sex abuse offences. His crime reporter, Mark Reddy. Mark, tell us about the police investigation. Yeah, Roz, this all came to a head this morning. Milton Okopoulos, the former Labour MP in New South Wales, he was arrested inside his cell at Silverwater Prison in Western Sydney. Now, detectives from Lake Macquarie travelled down to Sydney and commenced questioning early this morning. He was then charged with 15 new child sex abuse offences including five counts of aggravated sexual assault with a victim under 16 and three counts of causing a child under 14 to, to participate in child prostitution. Now, police will allege that he indecently and sexually assaulted two young boys known to him on two separate occasions at Lake Macquarie and on the New South Wales mid-north coast during the 90s. So this dates back quite some time. Uh, he is, of course, is in jail for allegedly breaching his parole on two occasions earlier this year. He is expected to face Newcastle Court tomorrow. OK, so tell us a bit more about his background. Yeah, so Milton Okopoulos uh, obviously spent 11 years for similar offences, child abuse offences involving multiple male victims that occurred over an 11-year period. Now, uh, he was... Uh, granted parole weeks before Christmas last year uh, and uh, he breached his parole on two occasions, meaning he was put back into prison. Now, he did spend time serving as a Swansea MP and also was promoted to uh, Aboriginal Affairs Minister in 2005. But then a year later, when this all unfolded, uh, he was sensationally stood down by the then Yemma government. And then, uh, of course, that really ended his political career. Uh, he then um, was convicted subsequently in 2008. So at this stage, uh, this is a historic allegation. And of course, uh, for legal reasons, we can't go into exactly what happened. But uh, this, of course, is now before the courts. Thanks, Mark.